it's Monday the 20th of July, this is the ECS Capital Morning Market Buy. Asian and US stocks were mixed on Friday for a fifth straight session, thanks to a major rally in Google, which sent the Nasdaq to its second record high, 52.10 for the year. However, gains were limited as energy stocks weighed on the markets and investors were cautious about taking high risk positions into the weekend. The Dow closed 33 points lower at 18.086. The S&P 500 gained two points to close at 21.26. The euro was trading around 1 spot 08240, hitting a two month low of 1 spot, 80, uh, 1 spot 08205 earlier in the session. If further negative news hits the markets, the euro could well fall below its lowest level, 1 spot 0819, since late April. Thor also climbed 0.1% to 12419 yen. The Aussie fell half a percent to 0 spot 7339. It dropped to its, dropped to its lowest level in six years. Gold collapsed 4% to a five year low at one point due to critical technical support levels being breached and the strength of the US dollar. US crude was down 22 cents at 50.67 a barrel this morning after falling more than 3% last week. The instrument has actually dropped more than 14% since July. Brent September crude was 15 cents lower at 56.95 a barrel. The benchmark had fallen just under 3% this week and has dropped nearly 10% this month. Within the equity space, all eyes are on Barclays this morning. After firing the chief executive uh, just under two years ago, the bank has now further plans to cut 30,000 more jobs in what it calls a cost-saving exercise. Barclays stock was down 0.3% in early trade at 279p per share. Within the indices space this morning, the FTSE is up 9 points trading around the 6.790 level. The DAX is up around 1 point trading around the 11.700 level. There is no major macroeconomic data releases this morning. That was the morning market bite. Thank you very much.